Welcome back to Suladan Place Star Wars The Old Republic. Last time we did quests. I forgot what quests we did. Oh yeah, we went and got stuff for people. There were scavengers and pirates and loot and other stuff. I need to find a dairy. That was lucky for me to find you that quick. Report your ailments. Sell. Sell the med pack. I guess I need to keep that. You are fit for duty. Return if there was a quick way to go back to my ship and give that to somebody and then come back. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I could. I don't have to Master. go to the ship. I can. Does this work on you? None. Okay, you can go back to the ship. I need T3. Bye. Do you like the box? Yes, here, have a box. Hooray! Okay, you can go back to the ship now. Yo! So, uh, what were we doing again? We were going to... I think we were going here. Where is he? I don't... I don't remember where I'm going. There. Where are we now? We're here. Is there a travel point? Can I have travel? That's these purple things, right? I'm learning how to map. Greetings. You are cleared for the following travel routes. That doesn't help me any. I want to go here. How do here? No, here. Our X speeder. Because this is only showing me the regional map, not the you big map. So I'm just going to pick the furthest away one and hope that because it's in another area, it will open up further travel points. Because I assume that's how this works. And if it doesn't, well, then we're just doomed. And now we wait. Funny enough, this is taking me almost exactly the route I needed to go, which is frightening. At some point, this thing's going to change course and all my hopes will be for nothing. Or it's going exactly where I want. I'm so concerned. Oh no, I see a quest marker. Come back. Where is it taking me? Does anyone have any idea where this thing's going? Because I sure don't. Does this doesn't this path looks nothing like what I clicked. Unless it's trying to take me way over here, which would just be stupid. It's trying to take me way over here. So is this the map it was using? I don't I don't even know. I don't know what logic it was using, because this 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 makes no sense to me. As far as, but this is not where I wanted to go. Uh, on the bright side, I spent all of 50 credits, but... Where are you taking me? Do you even know where you're... That is a big droid. It's taking me to my death. To derelict swoop tracks. Where, where, where... Where am I? Bud, you need a better Greetings. map. You are cleared for the following travel routes. I'm gonna go Are you here. Safe out there? Do I know where it goes? No, but I think I recognize the name Auric. So I need to go here. I guess we're flying again. For all the good that journey has done me. I don't even begin to know what is happening there. I 
right. Are we there yet? No, maybe, kind of, sort of. Oh, look, two more quests. I don't even know anymore why are there so many quests. Don't expect me to do every single quest. MMO logic tells me that there is probably a near, I mean, not literally infinite, but there's an unholy amount of quests probably because they don't expect you to ever actually finish the game. Eh. Sorry. Past experience has told me that if I dig too deep into trying to do every single quest in too large of a game, that eventually I lose track of what I'm doing entirely and wander off. And this is to this day why I've yet to finish Skyrim. I just, I end up in charge of the Wizards Guild. Whether I'm a wizard or not, I just end up in charge of the Wizards Guild. I think I, I don't remember what else happens. I build a house. I do lots of quests, and I don't think, as far as the plot goes, that I've made it much past, I think I've met the Greybeards once, like that first quest where you go talk to them and they're like, Dragonborn, and they're like, go find words, and then it's just, it, I never get anywhere. I still haven't finished Elden Ring. Like, when a game is too large and has too much to do, eventually I just, I get lost. Attention spans are wonderful things to have if you have them. I don't, I'm not touching that heroic two plus whatever, no. Can, can we, can we not be stuck in the train? Yo, who are you? Thank you for coming so fast. I told you the commander would send someone, Gartha. The commander didn't send him. Don't you recognize a Jedi when you see one? Then we really are saved. Master Jedi, may I please beg your aid? Have you ever faced a Rakul before? I mean, I've been infected by him about 30 times. Why? Is this a research station or something? We're a Republic archaeological salvage team cataloging those who died in the Teresian bombardment. Mostly, they call us the corpse counters. It's pointless work. People are dying out here, so the Republic can have a list they'll never look at. These people deserve someone to acknowledge their deaths. Only, uh. most of our team were lost this morning when Rackles cut us off. I was hoping that you might go see if anyone is still alive. Yeah, sure, why not? Um, question. Why did the Republic wait three centuries to decide that, yeah, maybe we ought to come count the dead? Also, I doubt orbital bombardment leaves much in way of, uh, you know, intact body parts for the cataloging of the dead. If there is any chance your Who friends Who are you live, and why are you in my cutscene? Thank you. Blah. I'm honored that you would help us. We were in the Zerka Works pipeline. If you go soon, there may still be someone <gasps> there. No, there's no hope for our friends now. But maybe you can make those monsters pay for what they did. I'm really confused and concerned and going to run away now. Where am I going? Where does the quest have me go? there. Excellent. I'm learning how to map. Can I go faster? Can I fly on the thing? When do I get a swoop? Watch it say that's a members only thing, despite you know the game telling me, oh yeah, save your money, you're going to want it for later when you inevitably eventually buy a swoop. And I'm going to get there and it's going to be like, oh no, 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 sorry, you're a peasant, no swoop for you. I'm joking around. I doubt it would do that. Would be kind of not funny in a ha ha way. Just a kind of sad shake your head. Just like yeah, why? Why not? Why? Am I, why? Why not? What am I doing here, by the way? Should I be in under in a pipe underground? I don't see any missing scientists. I also don't see any rat ghouls. Oh, look, rat ghouls. Not what I meant to do. Also, this is a random nitpick I do have with Swotor, and I know I've probably mentioned it before, but the lack of auto path. And I don't mean that annoying thing where some games have where it's just like you click on the quest and say like, okay, run to the quest. No, that, that's, that's not. I mean the thing where I could like say, that is a dead body. Click this enemy. 
hit this ability instead of out of range move closer it says out of range and my player character starts running towards it gets into range and then smacks it much like kotor or most other mmos that i've played i find it really weird that i don't and that's why you see me often initiate with force jump because it is the closest thing i have to the game automatically targeting and uh, not tar auto targeting automatically moving to the target From what I've seen online regarding that platinum coin. Uh, from what I've seen online, it's generally uh, the, the forum posts I've seen have been like, yeah, sorry, this game doesn't have that. Oh, well. Uh, and then a few posts of, well, they don't want people AFK farming and that would make it too easy. And I'm like, dude, people are going to find a way to do that no matter what you do. But uh, Anyway. Whatever the reasoning, yeah, that's why I jump into every fight and why sometimes you'll see me wait for jump to come off cooldown because I'm lazy like that. Uh, here, I found a coin. You can have it. I gained, I don't know if 90 influence is a lot or not. Chemical pipe rat ghouls. Well, there ain't 10 of them, so I hope this one counts. Yay, it counts. Come on, I'll get into range so I can smack you all at once. Nine, ten, all right. Search for the missing scientists. Any idea where they might be? Not here. Okay, you're fascinating. I really do love the game, don't get me wrong. I just find it weird that that mechanic is non-existent here. Uh, that and an auto attack. I know you do have a basic attack in, like, your, your one skill here, but the fact that your player character doesn't automatically queue it up if you don't tell them to do anything is just weird to me. That said, it was also annoying in KOTOR because of the nature of the attack queue that I often had to fight to put attacks into the queue. But... In this case, you don't have an attack queue. It's just like, which attack is set for next? <gasps> the experience boost thingum is still active, so it does save its state when you leave and come back, which is excellent, which means I can start using those. Um, but in neither case am I, like, saying that's a bad thing. The game doesn't have them. It's just something that's noticeable to me. But I'm, I'm fine with that. Data pad. This is for you, Gartha. I saw you ahead of me there, before the pack cut us off. Just want to tell you, you're wrong. The dead do care what happens to them after they die. No, they don't. I'm one of them now. I hear those monsters sniffing for me in the dark. And I know I'll be with the dead before anyone comes for us. And I do care. You're not dead but yet, I'd so I'd rather okay. lie here a thousand years undiscovered than have some greedy son of a hut like you dig me up just to see what I've got that's worth stealing. I hope someone else finds this and makes you pay for your crimes. Like I'm about to pay for mine. Um, also, slightly unrelated, but it would have been neat if, as he fell mid-talking, his cadence of speech had shifted to match what was happening. Instead, it sounded disconnected from what was happening. Also, if the data pad is doing audio recordings, you would have expected to hear some kind of thud sound instead of just utter silence. But that's just me. Hi, security droid friends. Someday I'm going to find HK-47 and he will be my droid. Ah. Uh, but yeah, just a slight oddity there. I mean, I guess you could say it's sci-fi technology and that the re data recorders are tuned specifically to the voice of person talking and not, like, the sound of a tree falling in the distance or other, you know, background things, but I don't know. It's just, just a thought. Anyway, yo, weird person. You're back, and I don't see anyone with you. Did you... are they... Dead. What did you think? The rat ghouls would buy them flowers and send them home? I mean, I, I, I kind of thought maybe the rat ghouls would be friendly, but... I'm sorry. Your friends are gone. But I made sure those rat ghouls will never kill again. 
Cold comfort. There's probably another swarm already moving in. Excuse me, I, I should call the base, tell their families what happened. I'm putting in for a transfer. No job is worth this. Is that why you're stealing? I hear you found a way to make it worth your while. What? What did you find? Was Elizu alive? What did that lying coward say about me? He left a confession. I, technically, he didn't leave a confession, but he did say it was wrong to rob the dead, so... You should have more respect for those murdered by the Sith. Three hundred years ago. Ha! All the Sith involved are just as dead as them. So fine, you found me out. Who cares? You're talking about people who died generations ago. I mean, your superiors probably care. We'll see if you think prisoners have as few rights as the dead. Very funny. The commander is sending a team to retrieve the bodies. Thank you for doing what you could. Uh, so guard has got a confession to make. Ask your partner what's been happening to the valuables you find. Oh, please. This is so humiliating. Yes, Ellie Sue and I were stealing some trinkets for the black market. The blasted dead don't cry over it. Why should you? How could you? You told me those boxes were going to the Republic Archive. Yeah, so I lied. What, you going to turn me in for that too? We'll work this out later. Kinda. We've asked enough of your time. Although, if you have a moment... Uh, what's going on? You sound like there's something more on your mind. Okay, this'll sound crazy, but there's more Rakuls at our grave sites than any of the Republic target zones. Ah, they're just drawn to the noise and the smell of flesh. We're not any noisier or fleshier than a platoon of soldiers. I think they're protecting their ancestors. Uh, explain. Ancestors? See, Rackles descend from sentience. It's a disease, one we know little about. But if my theory is correct, it'll be our first insight into how they think. This could be a first step toward taking the planet back from them. Uh, what can I do? Understanding your enemy is the key to defeating him. Exactly. Right now, Rackles are like something out of a nightmare. We never know when or where they'll attack. What? You're not sending them to the bombardment site, are you? That place is so thick with rat ghouls you can see them from orbit. Don't you interfere. We know what you think of the people of Terrace. I am right about this. Why else would they be so determined to guard the bombardment sites? If you could get samples from both the rat ghouls and the skeletons at one of the main sites, we could see if they're related. Yeah, sure, why not? We must learn the truth of this. Seriously, Sira. You think you can waste his valuable time on your crackpot theories? You don't tell me what to do anymore. We know how you feel about the people of Terrace. You've said Please that already. Please don't let Gartha discourage you. This is important. And I don't think there's anyone else on this planet willing to brave those rat ghouls to find out. I'll be waiting to hear what you find. I mean, I think it'd be really fun to use area of effect attacks inside of a large swarm of enemies, so sure. Level up! What was it doing? Where am I going? Where exactly is this bombardment site? Oh, up there. And up there. Okay, so this way. When do I get a floaty do? What level are you? Level 30. Okay. So the people I've seen that have floaty do seem to be in the level 30 range, so we're gonna hope for that. Also, I officially out level the planet, so I'm. <laughs> Gonna be level locked for a bit, which is funny. Also, I love that this thing holds its effect forever, like... That it does not continue ticking down when logged out, because I have seen games that do that, and it's so obnoxious, where it's like, Oh, hey, cool, five-hour experience boost. Better hope you plan to play for five hours! And it's just really, it feels punishing when you do that. So the fact that that thing is still in effect uh, tells me that the game is only counting. It's only counting down when I'm actively logged in. So I love that. I'm very happy with that. Even though I have a limited supply of those, and I'll probably never see them again once I, you know, finish getting to use them. I look. Ow. I love the fact that that lasts, and that I have a healer. Boy, that's a big hole in the ground. Yo, rat ghouls. Y'all want to fight? Come on, I want more than four of you. Come on. I'm gonna waste my time for four of you. 
There we go. Come on. Get all grouped up for me. Whee! Whee! Oh, this does not appear to be going to plan. They're still alive. If I didn't know that those are quest items, I would be so happy. Because that would usually mean they dropped rare stuff, but there would be no way that much rare stuff would drop all at once. Okay, bud, you need to go sell stuff. And I'm going to go down here and see if I can find some blood samples. This isn't where I go to get the blood samples. I feel like I've been here before. Probably have. Alright, well where do I get the people blood samples? I found a people. Oh, I just need genetic material, not specifically blood samples. I found another people. Hiding in the grass. Um, any idea where the peoples are? I mean, I'm not asking the game to, like, just throw them all in a pile for me, but... A little bit of a clue might be nice. Find another people. Yeah, I noticed you finished selling the items and didn't come back, which is, you know, tantamount to betrayal, sir. Lucky you cook good food, though. Yo, bud, you wanna, you know, maybe come back? Not abandon me in the middle of combat? Okay, I've already got that skeleton, so that one's not usable. Just get five genetic samples from one skeleton, I'm sure nobody would notice. <laughs> what happened and where am I? Can you, can you pick the skeleton clean, bud? I see another one up here. Oh, it will let me do it in combat. I really figured it was going to say can't do that in combat. Well, that's done. It's kind of funny there were two burial sites, but it I guess once you picked one, it just decides you don't need to go to the other one. Oh, look, I'm Rat Ghoul infected again. Oh. That's right, I have the little off hound focus totem thing. Heroic area. Okay, why is it a heroic area? What is a heroic area? These are all questions. Good gracious, how hard did I hit you? Good gracious. Come back, microphone. <laughs> I sneezed so hard the microphone had rotated. <laughs> Okay. Let me 
should be almost there. Oh man, walking back and forth to quests is kind of slow though. The Republic sent a unit to retrieve our team's bodies. They said to thank you for your help. Aren't you going to ask if he wasted his time on your pet project? Why do you always try to ruin everything? Do Solston moms not hug their children or something? Um, did you get to the bombardment site? I don't see a scratch on you. There you go. The Rackools didn't want to give up their blood, but I convinced them. I'm sure you can be quite persuasive. Just let me see the samples. I've got a portable scanner that can give us preliminary results right now. That's amazing. There's over a 50% correlation. Genetic drift usually means a much less marked connection, even in a normal population after so many years. Uh, explain. They really are defending their ancestors then. It means we just made one of the most important discoveries in Teresian history. Well, you what? Seem to have Where's the cynical your... disbelief? You can't dispute the numbers, Sira. You're right. This is amazing. If rat ghouls have enough rationality to remember people and places that matter to them, we can't keep treating them like mindless animals. Mm, you think they're sentient? If they can think, maybe someday we can make peace with them. Exactly. We need to cancel our operations in these grave sites. We can't keep antagonizing them. But if we know they come to the defense of certain territories, we can bait them, draw them out, so the Republic can send in troops to exterminate them. No. If they're sentient, we can't just keep murdering them. I'll contact the Reconstruction Authority. Do you have an opinion on this? Uh, I say study them further. If there's any way to coexist peacefully with the Rat Ghouls, we should take it. I... I guess it's a virtue to forgive, right? At least this way, maybe we can avoid those kind of attacks in the future. I'll give the Republic your recommendation. Thank you again for all your help. From a writing stance, it's weird to me that it's you've had a reversal where suddenly she's the one that sounds like the bad guy, and he's all excited over it when minutes before he was... I don't know. That That's weird. Yay! I got XP's. I'm nowhere closer to what we came here to do, though. Well, actually, I am, because... It looks like that's right over here. So we got a purple quest over here. I don't know if I should trust you being all purple. But I'm going to go ahead and pause here. Thank you for watching. And next time we'll see what this Wake of the Spire is. See you next time.